Take 48. I'm Robert Chase. I'm Mike Smith. This guy rolls in like it's some sort of party. He's ready to go. Oh, He's at the bar here in, yeah. the, in the studio. Triple fisting, baby. I'm like a mimosa, actually, about right now, yeah, Mike. We'll talk uh, about how to whip up that sometime. Mimosas yeah. for the morning tramp. Okay. <laughs> I guess it's, champ it's champagne and orange juice, or sparkling wine and orange juice, really. Yeah, but we'll have to do expensive stuff, because we're just not cheaping it out on the show. Well, now, I like the way you roll. Now <laughs> you're talking. Okay, so it's uh, Wine Wednesday, Wine Guy Mike, present and accounted for, along with uh, an array of bottles that have already been corked. Yeah, I got them all ready for the show this morning, and uh, coming in here, and uh, we're going to be traveling down to Sonoma this week on Are the Wine we? Guy Mike show, and I've got... A really great uh, American story. Uh, the Boledo Vineyards and Winery down in Sonoma is a great story. Uh, John Boledo, he originally was a vegetable farmer, and then with the uh, NAFTA agreement, things changed drastically uh, economically in that industry uh, with the importing of vegetables from outside the country. And uh, being the entrepreneur and hardworking guy that he is, he switched gears seamlessly and started growing grapes. And he grows some great grapes. He's got great juice. Um, I'm going to be joined uh, this week uh, on the show by uh, Anthony Beckman, who's their head winemaker. And he's going to tell us a little bit about the special terroir down in Sonoma on the Russian River and what it translates to for our listeners in this bottle. All right, and again, uh, the bottles you'll be talking about uh, are available locally? They are. I've got a Pinot Gris, uh, Chardonnay, and a very showy Pinot Noir. Showy, a term which denotes... Kind of flamboyant, kind of elegant, kind okay. of uh, just sophisticated, but at a price point that's uh, real doable for us regular wine drinkers. All right, it's Wine Guy Mike, you hear him. Uh, Sunday morning, 10 o'clock on the trail. That's right after E-Town, that hour of music and conversation on the trail, 1033. So Wine Guy Mike also with a blog. Yeah, we're at www.wineguymike.wordpress.com. And I'm going to really be uh, breaking this story out. And, hey, I want to thank our sponsors, Chow Mambo, for mm -hmm. the phenomenal dinner I had down there last Ooh. night. Took, right. took the wife out. We had a great dinner, a great time, and uh, it's always a good experience at Chow Mambo. All right, nice. And getting some uh, good feedback on the blog, people participating. Uh, you know, yeah, we got the blog. Uh, about nine other people picked it up this week, and we're blasting it around the country. So, uh, you know, the trail and the Wine Guy Mike show are doing a phenomenal job, and people are drinking it up. So there you go. Check it out. Again, uh, on the blog or on the trail, it's Wine Guy Mike, Sunday morning, 10 o'clock, and again, sponsored by Chow Mamba. All right, Cheers, everybody. Cheers. Cheers. 8.51 at the trail.